There are many investments to choose from. Ones that offer you a higher but more volatile return and others that offer you a lower but a more stable return. Investing directly in the market can be tricky. Which stocks do you buy and why? There are many shares to choose from. Do you buy the big, well-established companies that have been around for some time and look like a safe bet? Or the smaller companies who are not yet well-established but hungry and looking for new opportunities? Do you buy the stock of a company that mines for gold, platinum or silver? The world would always need gold, you think, but can there ever be too much out there? How about investing in the shares of a company from which you buy your groceries daily? Surely, if you and everyone else you know shops there, then you can't go wrong. They must be doing well. Wait, what about a financial institution from which you have a loan? Perhaps you're thinking, maybe I can make some of the money back I owe them if I invest in their stock. But what if other people who owe them money don't pay it back? Will your investment still make money? Or you could have gotten a hot tip from a friend about this other company that are developing this awesome product that's going to be amazing when it comes out. Everyone's going to want one. It's a sure thing. Perhaps you'll buy that instead. You could buy one or all of these, of course. But ask yourself, have you really considered the risks? Have you thought about how the company is run? What are the hardships they face in trying to make a profit? Because remember, they need to make a profit if their stock is to increase in value, and thus your investment in them is to increase in value too. Think of it this way. If the company you wanted to buy needed engineers to run its operations, wouldn't you be more informed if you were an engineer who also understood how the company works? What are they doing right and what are they doing wrong? Someone who could visit the company and see how they do things and how they operate. Perhaps then you might think differently or see things differently. What if you wanted to buy the stock of a financial institution? Do you see it in the same way as an accountant or an economist? Do you understand what would happen to your investment in that company if interest rates were to go up or down? Or a financial institution in New York, London or Iceland you've never heard of suddenly goes bankrupt? Do you know how that would affect your investment? What if you were a business scientist who studies businesses the same way a scientist studies atoms, plants, the earth or the galaxy? Well, you could be. You could be all of these. At Sunlum Investments, we have a unit trust called the General Equity Unit Trust. This is a unit trust anyone can buy that selects stocks across the market to invest in. But the people selecting which companies to buy or sell are business scientists, engineers, economists, accountants and mathematicians. The Sunlum General Equity Unit Trust has a large, stable and diverse team of analysts whose sole job is to look at companies under a microscope. From morning to evening, they look at companies inside and out until they know everything there is to know about them. They understand how they work, why they work, where they'll make money and how investing in those companies can grow your investment. They make investing simpler for you.